header tags are an important part of SEO. So you've written your page content, you're going to have header tags throughout your website. Now, what this is going to be slightly controversial. What works well for me is header two tags. I believe that H1 tags have been spammed galore um, by <laughs> everyone out there who believe that header tags are an important ranking signal and they probably were right when they were doing well they were right when they were doing that but I through my own testing and I always do a lot of tests I find that header two tags get taken more seriously by Google now and it's not just me who thinks that there's a lot of other people who try and test it and they seem to see better results using header two tags. So what you're going to do with a page is you're going to have a nice clean URL, you're going to have a nice title tag, and then what you would use is your header tags throughout the content on your website to carry uh, to capture variations of keywords. As I say, I would always encourage you using an H2 tag um, throughout the main body of your content. That works very well for me at present and something I would encourage anyone else to go ahead and use. Um, by default on WordPress, you are, when you put the page name in, you will have one header, one tag, which is normally by default on most templates. You're, you will have one uh, header, one tag, which will be the name of your page and then every other tag throughout the main body of your content will be header two and that will hopefully give you some good on-page SEO.